Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls. This is our daily angelic message. So we have a color card here and the color is brown. Uh, establish boundaries. Oh, what is my whole thing? Establish boundaries, okay? So we have the number 12 here. 12 can also be seen as a sacred, a sacred number. It's a sacred number of completion. Now, if you wanted to reduce that to three, I suppose you could, you could sneak that one in there. <laughs> but this is a digging into your wisdom. So establish boundaries again comes from i think it's very archangel sandalfin sandalfin can also be seen with like a turquoise color but sandalfin is all about the earth star chakra and helping you feel balanced secure aligning your chakras he's also known as the archangel of music of sound healing all of that what this is telling me is that as all these changes happen there will be people that try to just take it out on the nearest person there are going to be people who are not responding well to this. And this is saying, you don't need to take that in. Just because someone else hasn't done the work and the work, what does that entail? That entails um, looking at your situation, um, trying to understand what was behind it. It can also be about taking accountability. You know, a lot of people love to just play the victim. They have a sad story and they expect it. And it's, it's so wild to me. I see all around me how people just fall into someone's sad story and they think that that person is a genuine victim and they're not, they're not. They brainwash the people around them to make them think that they deserve all of this, you know, energy. And that's what it is. They are their own little personal starving little vortex and it's just trying to suck all that energy into it. This card, if you notice, there's this little, this little life here, right? <laughs> it is blooming. It's coming to the surface. And this is saying it, the time is here that, you know, since 2012, we were talking about people quote unquote being left behind and per the human brain, per usual, we were like, Oh, that means we're going to like lift out of these bodies. Then we're going to meet the mothership and I don't know, the whole world implodes and we just end up on a different planet. Something like that, right? <laughs> but, but what we have learned is that um, the breakdown is much more subtle. It's, it's actually, I think the word is subtler, but that's weird to say. So we'll say more subtle, okay? Um, it, it's more subtle than that. It's I'm not going to use this word, but let's just say it's the expulsion of darkness. And I just saw a lot of stuff coming out of people, like shadows coming out of people and those shadows clawing to maintain control. And I'm not overstating that. You believe this or you don't. Okay. Like I'm just out here trying to get along. Okay. And I'll help in any way that I can. This is not so that you get unhinged and you start going down this road of like, oh my God, it's going to be like all the storybooks that are ever out there. It's not that. It's under the radar. It's under the radar. The, the way the darkness has won is by, they're using the word glitching. Glitching otherwise good humans. You've been glitched. I've been glitched. We just need to start the process of recovery. And I don't know what that looks like. <laughs> Sorry, I know you probably can't have an answer, but I don't got them. Are you kidding me? I, I didn't do this. I, I didn't design all this nonsense. But <laughs> but we, we have these little bits of information that are coming through as is the right time for us to hear it. So if that resonates with you, this is not so you can go off in your mind and put some wacko story around something. That's not what it is, okay? <laughs> like we, we need to be listening to our hearts our hearts will guide us. Okay. We're gonna leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.